Hello everybody, it is I, the Waluigi Big Mac, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play. Uh, this time we're doing a hat in time. Uh, yeah, so, I'll be, so a few things. Uh, first thing first, I got a brand new microphone. So, so things will be sounding a lot more better, but at the same sense, it is a desk microphone. Which means you'll be hearing all my button inputs, or, and my button presses. So hopefully that doesn't bother, bother you guys too much, uh. Second, and secondly, I'm not sure how this less space is going to go, because I tried recording this uh, a bit earlier today. And, well, to say at the very least, the game was not cooperating with me at all. It just, it just kept taking an absurd long time to load. Anyway, we're going to start a new game. Uh, hopefully, hopefully the game will cooperate a bit better this time. Because I do not want to jump cut a bunch just to, uh, okay. So far, so good. <laughs> So far, so good. Anyway, uh, we were, well, here's our protagonist, Hackett, and she's sleep she's sleeping right now. And, honestly, I would rather be sleeping right now, but... Honestly, I, I think I had, like, a... Good morning! And more than, more than an eight-hour sleep, so I think I should be fine. Adventure. You are only five light years away from your destination, home. The yeah, anyway, we're trying to get home. Yeah, I don't I don't care about the I don't care about the to-do list here. Anyway, here's the main game. Uh we can double jump. Uh we can dash midair. We can do a little dive there. Uh we can punch. That it doesn't do much. Uh what's in here? Punch. Uh Every time we sit in a chair, time slow down for some reason. I don't know. I I honestly do not know why. Anyway. Uh, a closet. You only really wear one outfit. So there's a lot. So there's lots of room for skeletons. Oh boy. A teddy bear. A ball that looks like a, a friendly face you'll probably find later. And be going with you. Anyway. Anyway, let's get through this game's plot. Uh, let's sit down first. I need at least one to do that, and I don't think so. Okay, cool, I only have one hat. In my other save file, I removed a bunch of modded hats. And it's still in that same file, so... Anyway. Wait a minute, we have 40 out of 40. That doesn't make sense. Anyway, we're about midway through uh, trying to get home. Oh, yeah, I can move around during cutscenes. This is nice. Anyway, what is all that rock ruckus? Who's this funny fella? What is this? Flying boat? All boats need to pay toll in Mafia Town. Even in space! Mafia come in to collect. Uh, how about no? Nice, nice job, Dingus. He now, he now opened up a vacuum in space. Uh, also, one of, one of, one of his work. Yeah, that's our fuel. That's our fuel right there. All, all forty of it, gone. And I mean, we're, I mean, we're not even upset. We're just, we're just. Slight, we're just slightly inconvenienced by this. Anyway, welcome to Mafia Town. Well, hopefully, I'm just gonna place the controller down. Hopefully, this is gonna load up. Hopefully, this is gonna load up decently fast now that I've removed a bunch of bots. I hope so. Okay, good. 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 Okay. Okay, no longer have to worry about jump cutting. Anyway, welcome to Mafia Town. This is all your fault.
Anyway. I wonder who this... Oh, there's a water poster for her. Wanted by Mafia HQ. Girl, or, girl wear red to it. It's scary. If fan, we give octopus to you. Hi. Anyway. Let's talk to these guys. Hey, fellow Mafia watch TV last night? Confusing science owls say small people can jump double in air. I saw. This makes Mafia uncomfortable with body. <laughs> Must go work out. I love the Mafia. They're fu they're funny fellas. Anyway, yep, that, that's basically the game telling you you can double jump. Now, there's a few things we can do here before we actually, you know, do the objective. What? Uh, we have to find uh, the red vault, co vault codes here. Now, they're pretty easy to find. Here's number two. And before we find number three, kick that. Fuck you. I didn't do it. Uh, anyway, there's different, uh, there are different stuff here. All roads lead to Mafia. Not good. Big immigration probe. We fix this by moving to island. Now no road lead to Mafia. Anyways. Anyway, here's... Oh, here's number three. Uh, there's two different th collectibles right now. Those green circles right there are pods. Those are our currency. The ones right here are our life pods. They give us health. Let's see. We cannot grab that. Because we're missing something important. A hat, per se. Anyway, let's open this. We get, we get ourselves a bunch of pods. And then sprint yarn. Now, what are yarn used for? Making new hats. Now, you do not need the same yarn to, to create uh, a new hat. You can Any yarn you find can be combined to create a new, a new hat. You just need to find a unique type of yarn in order to unlock being able to create, create a hat. Anyway, let's collect a bunch of these because we're going to be getting something important. Oh, the first chair. Let's slow down time, shall we? Anyway, enough of that. God damn it. Anyway, I'll be only doing that once. Let's talk to you. I punch Beryl dressed as old lady. It makes people scared of Mafia. Life of Mafia is good. Beryl dressed as old lady. And they do it just to scare people. That is, uh... Well, that is grade A douchebaggery there. Anyway... Now, I need to collect at least 50 of these pawns here. And we, unfortunately, we cannot save that old dude. Anyway. Anyway, let's talk to you. Hi young one. I am from a far away land. I've seen every corner of the earth. Well, that explains, well, that explains why he is glitching out. My discoveries. You may call me the badge seller, for I sell and trade badges. I can provide you with strong abilities and upgrades to your hat. If you have money, of course. So this is so this is where a good chunk of the game comes from. Uh sometimes you're gonna need these are these are like side grades or whatever to uh improve your gameplay experience. Now so far we have access to three badges. Eight hundred pawns for this one, the mumble badge. This does nothing but uh makes all the character dialogues into Banjo kazooie dialogue. Where it goes or like something like that. Or it's just, where it's just a, what, where it's just one syllable just being repeat, like a bunch of different syllables just being repeated to, uh, to sound like, uh, sentencing. Yeah. So that's that badge. The hover badge automatically pulls, you all magically pull out the umbrella before a deadly impact. So essentially, pre prevents you from taking fall damage. Can be useful. Right there, we're, we're gonna get the, uh, the item magnet badge, which basically attracts all nearby collectibles, which is useful because, especially for, like, the early game. Now, you can hold up the you can have up to three badges equipped at a time. Hey you! Down there! Don't think I didn't see you stalking me! Us kids should stick together, not stalk. I'm trying to stay quiet another. for the dialogue. Mafia just out in really dangerous place. So what do you say? 
Wanna join my little rebellion? Oh, yeah, the, the let's rebel against the mafia. They're jerks. They broke they broke my the window. They deserve it. From the sky? Yeah? Yikes. Looks like you've got a lot of cleaning up to do, huh? I I blame the mafia. Tell you what. Come up here and I can show you where Yep. I'll do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we'll skip that. Yep. Well, I see something I can do right off the bat. Follow me, Rebel Squad. All right. Yeah. I'm gonna ignore that first. If you press right trigger while standing still, you can crawl. And we got ourselves uh, the ability to create a yard, a new hat, the sprint hat. And let's equip it. So we, we can press left bumper to switch hats. Ref, pressing, pressing left trigger is how you use your uh, hat's ability. So the sprint hat is self-explanatory. It allows you to run and sprint. Hey, I think one of your junk pieces fell and smashed right into the market's fountain. Messed it up real good. When going over there, just avoid making eye contact with the Mafia and you'll see ya. I shall make eye contact with the Mafia. I want them to know that they're going to be dealing with me. Now, now you might be wondering what the other hat gimmick is. Tell you where the objective is. That's it. Anyway, you. Uh, hey. oh. That is mine. <laughs> I I know I know have weapon now. Down with the mafia! God, I I, I love that sound. I love that sound bite. Now we can attack any mafia now. Now, majority of the time, most mafia aren't gonna aren't gonna attack us. Some mafia we can't even hit at all. Like, see this guy? We can't hit him. Let's see. Well, let's see if we can do a bit, a few more things over here before we actually grab this. Ah, uh, the beauty of, of games now, games like this, like, are based on like 60, Mario 64 and whatnot. Oh wow, we can even collect that already. Already cool. Vaults around city belong to mafia. No touch. <laughs> mafia joking. Child can't open vault. Vault secured with code. Wait, mafia code not in pocket. Yeah, yeah. Now this. Now this blue vault is also pretty easy to to find where everything is. Okay, let's see. There's one. Let's see. Don't don't worry about those. Uh... Whew. Thank God for that. Get back here. Damn. There we go. Three. Let's open you. And we got ourselves a brewing yarn. Takes four yarns to open. Uh, to make. Yeah, he doesn't remark anything about us opening the vault. What's all these guys? Well, I should also mention. Uh, if you hit a, a, a docile, uh, uh, mafia, they will start attacking you. And if it, if it was one that has dialogue from before, uh, you won't be able to talk to them. Even after you, even after you leave them alone. Yeah, so these mafias don't forget. Anyway, let's grab, let's grab the, uh, timepiece. Because we screwed it. We screwed around for about half the episode, so, uh, hey, that's nice. And things should be loading a bit better now. Yep, definitely loading a lot better now. That's good. Whew, that's real good. Alrighty then. 
Now, there's, no there's nothing else we can do at the moment. So, we'll just continue on. Hmm, my computer's being a bit loud for some reason. I mean, it's not, it's not warm or anything. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on that. Anyway, here's level, here's Act 2 of Chapter 1, Barrel Battle. This is technically our first boss battle. Now, I could do a bit more exploring, but... Eh, you know what? I could actually do a bit more exploring. Anything interesting over here? Eh, not really. Well, well, we accidentally hit the dumpster, so now we're stinky. Fear me, Mafia. I'm, I'm stinky. Oh yeah, one thing you should mention, birds. They see you, they're gonna go after you regardless. Luckily, they only, they only take one hit. That guy is just gonna leave us alone. That's fine. Yep. It'll be helpful uh, to have the sprint hat on because that means we can get places faster. Hey. Unfortunately, while sprinting, you cannot double jump. Anyway, let's grab a yarn here. Woo. That was a good save. Let's see. We need one more yarn and then we can trade the, the next hat. Uh, well, good news is we can make our next hat now. I just have to do a bit of platforming here. There we go. And just like that. Yep, 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 I get. Anyway. Gotcha. We have ourselves the, uh, the brewing app. I had to look up the name for a moment. Anyway, what this do? Well, obviously the trigger is the hat ability. You get to throw projectiles. And these projectiles can break certain objects. Like, like see that box over there? Let's see if I can... Well, I'm gonna have to go over here. But yeah, that's how you break all that stuff over there. Yep. Man, I'm doing a... I'm basically ignoring the objective. Uh. I bonked and fell. Anyway... Can I hurt this guy? No, I get not. All right, he's peacefully sleeping. All right, we'll leave him be then. It's a good idea to break all these because that's a, that's a good way of getting a lot of pots. They can use to buy shit. Anyway, there's a bull here. Anyway, I think I screwed around enough. I th let's let's go let's go to where the objective is. Now, since we have the brewing hat, this fight would be a bit more easier. Oh, hey, the magic guys over there. Uh, you want? Know let's detour a bit and see what see what our friendly badge guy has in store for us. 
Not everything I sell is of value. I also sell terrible badges, and yet people buy them anyway. Uh, let's get the let's get the hover badge because we can afford it, and also we can ignore fall damage for a bit. Like for the most part, for the most part, you can just double jump to avoid uh, fall damage, like you can do in most games. Except for Elder Ring, for some reason, for some reason, even if you double jump as you're falling down, you still take damage. It's a bit it's a bit weird, but uh, whatever, I guess. Anyway, oh, we can only have one badge on right now. I think I think there are upgrades you can get at some point that allows you to hold up the three. Yeah, so I guess we'll keep the magnet badge on for right now. Man, we're getting a lot of yarn. Next time we find, we might be able to just flat out create. Anyway, most of these Mafia will just ignore us. Anyway, let's let's go deal with this. Hey. Child, shoo! Mafia can't have child witness when Mafia teaching lesson. Anyway, we're just gonna stare at him. Oh? This awkward for Mafia. Mafia not sure what to do, boss. What do we do with eyewitness? Teach her lesson, boys. Also, I think it I think it is implied that these guys are Russian. Anyway. There we go. Enough! Mafia won't bow to little girl. Prepare to feel Mafia's Anyway, here comes the tricky part of this fight, the barrels. Heads up, little punk! Stand still! Do not think about avoiding barrels! Yep, and now this is where it gets tricky. See if girl can handle this barrel. Alright. Okay, we did it. I only took one hit this time. Normally, I, normally I'm down to my last health. Ow! Okay, I was nowhere near him. I'm just gonna lay me out by projectiles. What's going on? Yeah, there we go. That's that. And well, that's that. That's that's our second time. That wasn't that that wasn't too bad. Psh, can you believe them? What a bunch of losers. Hey, you're alright, new kid. Do you have a name? No? You shy? That's cool. You're a less talk more fighting kind of girl, I take. That thing you grab there. Are you collecting them? 
because I know where there's more of them. They've been raining from the sky ever since you arrived. I've seen the goons bring them to their headquarters way up there. Yep, so it looks like we're going to have to heist their headquarters just to get our <gasps> ship back. go up there and get your junk. It'll be fun. I'll take any opportunity that involves messing up the mafia. You with me, buddy? There we go. Friends. Intruder alert! I see. Are you ready to take down some mafia? Let's do it! I'm psyched! Anyway. Let's go over the plan. All assaults need a good plan, or it'll be a flop. First, we strangle them, choke them, and watch them beg for mercy. Ooh, a bit hardcore. Them. I like it. I like no, it. No, wait. Strangling is too kind. What? We smash them together into mush and put their remains in a jar. Uh, uh, I don't know about that. Then, we sell the jar for pocket money. That'll be the ultimate salt in the wound. <laughs> <clears throat> but first, we have to... Uh, Make it through their Mafia HQ. Bad dump. Probably smells. Once we find and dethrone the Mafia boss, the rest will follow. Then our mush and jar party will be no problem. We've got to get you geared up. Your hat is basic. And we don't do basic in this gang. Yarn can be found around Mafia Town and used to stitch new hats if you're crying. Yeah, I've been doing that already. I've, collected one. I've been doing that already. You need more yarn for some hats than others. I guess being creative isn't free. <laughs> now you're a killing machine. Let's go. Anyway, yep, that's all that. Let's break all this. We now have access to this. It will, we do not have enough tokens, but this allows us to get like different music, uh, different hat decorations. Yes, there are hat decorations. Fundamentally, they... They just, it's like, to put it this way, they can just replace what the hat you're wearing, but still do the same task. Now you're a kid. Yep. Uh, you know what? I think I'll end off the episode early because it'll probably take too long to do another, uh, do another, uh, do another level. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, uh, enjoy the episode. If you, if you guys are looking forward for more, uh, videos of this game, please consider subscribing because... I would really appreciate it. Uh, comedy might also help, but I, I, but honestly, I just want some, but honestly, I just, uh, I've been noticing that a lot of people haven't been subscribing to my, to my channel, and I have a phone to pick with most of you. If you make it through the video, I appreciate it, but a, subs a subscription would also help. Anyway. With that being said, I hope you guys have a good day, night, afternoon, where we are in the world. And I'll see you guys in the next episode, where we'll be beating up some more Mafia. Until then, see you later. Bye-bye.